But I, I think where a lot of people struggles, and I, I can see that in, in, in organizations or in companies, it's, it's also to, to admit that it is a failure, or you can say it's a learning, um, because failure is negative. Um, but, but to admit it, it's so vulnerable, right? To go in there and saying, hey, this is not either not working, or we need to find a plan, but to admit that it happened without pointing a finger and saying it was there, it happened in that team. Um, any, mm -hmm. any recommendations of, of how to, to build the trust so it's not going to be this blaming game? You know, I guess as, as you state that question, I think of a few things. Uh, when I think of in a corporate environment, for example, uh, I'll go back to something earlier I said, and I left the corporate world uh, decades ago, so I, I can't speak to the inner workings of corporate culture, although I hear it, I can see it, I've got friends in it. Um, I think the number one thing that I could advise a leader to do, an achiever to do, see, I'm, I'm only speaking to people who are leadership minded and achievement minded. I'm not speaking to the average person who's just going to work to get a job, to do what they're told to do, do, as, do it as little as they possibly can so they can get paid uh, every couple of weeks. That's not who I'm speaking to. No, no, no. I'm not trying to get, you know, I'm talking to the leader. So how does a leader survive a uh, failure? How does an achiever deal with the attack? And yeah. that is, it, and this is a really hard statement for some people to get their hands on, but I have to credit this to Jack Canfield who taught this to me uh, over a decade and a half ago. And that is, it's all your fault. So what is that? Feel, that feels real heavy, right? When you, yeah. <laughs> when you're, when you're on a team of leaders yeah. and someone else didn't do their, their job to your left or to your right, yeah. or when you're uh, handed down an assignment and maybe you have a team, but here's the, the, the simple reality is if we are going to move forward in life, if we're going to move forward in career, in cooperation and teamwork, leaders take responsibility. What will you do to unlock innovation?